Friends, a lot of you have asked me how to add the Solana network on MetaMask and receive your Solana. So if you are looking to withdraw, say, funds from your Coinbase or Binance or any other exchange and bring it to your own MetaMask app or browser installation, how do you get Solana here? So you must know that when you use MetaMask, you have various accounts and within that you have various networks. For example, here if I open Optimism, I can see my profile on Optimism. I can look at the Ethereum chain and you have option to add new chain by clicking add network. But you need to understand one concept, one basic concept that if you are on MetaMask, you are in a way in the Ethereum ecosystem. Ethereum ecosystem means there is a standard called from what I believe ERC20 and if you look at this uh, article here it straight away talks about what are ERC20 tokens on the Ethereum network so any token like even BNB for that matter which is not built upon Ethereum but it uses the Ethereum technology to build its own chain so it's compatible with MetaMask. So unlike Trust Wallet and some other wallets, MetaMask honestly cannot support Solana. Now this may have been true because you know there is something called Wrapped BTC. So if I search WBTC, you know there is something called Wrapped BTC. So technically you could hold a Wrapped version. Uh, you could say a synthetic version of Bitcoin on MetaMask. Even that is possible. But for Solana, honestly, I would say Solana, I have seen Phantom Wallet be the one which is most recommended for Solana. So just go to phantom.app. I will give you the link in description. Download it for Brave and I will help you understand how to set it up and get your Solana wallet up and running, which will run just like MetaMask for you and you can withdraw your Solana and maintain it. So I'm going to click add extension and get this extension installed on my Brave browser here. You could also download its mobile app. It will work exactly the same. And once I am on Phantom, you can see I have an option to create a new wallet or import an existing wallet. If I go to my extensions, I have the option to just use uh, a pin over here and pin it right here on the top so I can see it. Now to create a new wallet, I need to first set a local password. So, okay, I've set up a local password and now these are my secret recovery phrase. These are my seeds in a way which I need to save. So let me just quickly save them as well. I will confirm that I have saved my recovery phrase and click continue and we are all good to get started. So once I click the phantom app, woo, it says I can now receive Bitcoin here, send receive Bitcoin, which is great. But here we are, it has support for multiple tokens, but top of the list is Solana. I can say receive Solana here and this is the QR code or the address. Uh, as you can see, I'll just paste it in the browser here. This is the address on which Solana can be received by me on this wallet, which is so cool. So this phantom app has been set up. There is again uh, an option for uh, adding more accounts and playing around with it if you want a full tutorial on um, phantom wallet do let me know i'll make a tutorial for you but for now this is how you get your solana on your own wallet you cannot get it on metamask do not fall for false tutorials which tell you how to do they can't help you there